this is Sheila She's Beautiful Irvin, and welcome back to my channel. Hi, this will be a video on putting together my square Phoebe quilted chair I got from Impression Vanity. I'm going to put this together and let you guys see what beauty will come of it. I will do my best to put this thing together as I'm doing it on my own. This is something my husband would usually do. I've had all these pieces and everything in the floor. So, let's get started. Let's see if I can tilt this a little bit so you all can see what we got going on here. Let's see if I can get this tilted a little bit more. I'll do my best, you guys, to get you all in the view. Uh, let's see. Get this tilted. We'll be a okay. And now somebody wants to call. But I'm so sorry. They're going to have to wait. This is my time. And it ain't even important. Whoever it is can't be. Alrighty. Let's get this together. Okay. Here's the sheet. Little instructions, I reckon. Yep, exactly what it is. It's got everything that I'm supposed to have to get this chair together. So, okay, we have this beautiful chair. Yeah, a little bit of an addition, I guess that's from the travel. Okay, and then we have the feet or the stand. Let's get some of this stuff off up here. It don't look like it should be too hard to put together. But I've never put a chair together before. I pretty much like to have them already assembled when I get them. But the way this chair looked on the website, it's gorgeous. I'm gonna love it. I hope I do this right, y'all. All right. What's this? This seems to be the pole, I'm thinking. Where's my handy dandy scissors? Come here, scissors. Let's see. They really have this stuff packed. Look at that. They did a good number on packing this stuff. And that's what it is. It's the lifting rod. Alrighty. Alright, let's see. What's this? Hmm. This part here. Okay. This part. They don't go on yet. Let me pay attention to this paper. I hate paper. I hate trying to do things by looking at the paper. Let's see. Number one, you got to put the feet on the bottom first. So this is the bag of wheels. I said feet, but it's wheels. Charge to my head, not my heart. Right, this is what the bottom looks like. I'm gonna get these beautiful babies in here. That one hard. Alrighty, hey, they made that simple. I like it when it's that simple. Come on, don't start acting up now. You guys, I'm trying my best to get this vanity room complete as I've not been filming because of all the moderations I've been doing with this room. Alrighty, we got that part going, y'all. Look at that. Hey, we got that going. Okay, now we have this little thing of my bobby. It fits down here in between the legs. Just like so. And then we have this beautiful thingy. 
which goes uh, up this way. So, it says this goes like that. See there? We've done that. We've got the feet and the wheels. Well, you know, the base and the wheels. And then we have the little thing that holds the bar onto the the base. Okay, we got this part on. Does it supposed to snap or anything? I ain't sure. I don't see nothing. I guess just get that in there first. We'll, we'll work with that after the fact. Because there's more to it, I'm, I'm believing. Alrighty. Now it says the screws. Which I'm thinking now, part three, it says to, I'm thinking we got to put the arm on here somewhere. I don't know. Hey, it's about to get real. Okay. I'm thinking that's this part here. I got to put that on to the chair. H, long screw. I have the screws right here. I'm hoping these are just all the screws that I'm going to need for right now. All right. I don't know one screw from the other. Uh... One, two, three, four. There's four screws. One, two. Well, let's find the four long screws. Okay. We got four long screws, four small screws. All right. Now here's the chair. And they do have on the bottom of this chair, I guess, these little holes where everything is supposed to go. So, let me grab this piece of beauty. And my chair sits, goes this way, I'm thinking. Y'all better pray for me. I'm trying not to put this seat on backwards. <laughs> Woo wee. Okay. I think it's this way. Now, we're going to do this. I see. Let's see. Ooh, I know that don't go that way, honey. I know I'm lying. Okay. And it definitely don't. Let me see. Yeah, it go that way. Just like this. Look at that. Coming in the form. Like my girl Kiki say, coming in the form. All right. And that's what it looks like. Okay. Let me, let me look. Let me get a good close look. Now, what I don't see is the little bitty, um, which got those things like the little, the flat, rounded pieces? I don't think I got rid of them, but I don't see them. I sure don't see them. Let me see, maybe. Let's just hope. Because I don't want to miss anything. Let me check everything out. But I only saw these screws and the little tool here. I didn't see any of the little um, other pieces that went on here. But I'm going to look in here just in case they may be in this piece here. Because I did not open everything. And it's a shame to even have anything missing. So, But hey, we're going to work with it. We are going to work with it because the main pieces are on here, but I just don't see those, those little brackets, and I, I'm pretty good at keeping up with everything, but hey, 
Here's the chair. Go ahead and put this on. I don't want to waste too much time. I'm trying to get this done as quick as possible. Screws in there. Let's get these screws set up. And the base of this is like really thick, so I'm pretty sure it's rather sturdy without those little pieces on there. hands are so tiny sometimes it's good to have a man's hands around other than just filling on stuff let's see all right let's make sure i'm doing this right i'm, I'm staying on the steps now i'm staying on the steps I'm blind as a bat, that for sure. Well, we got that. All right. Let's get that locked in. Y'all notice they started to make these. Well, you don't have the regular screwdriver in use anymore. Everything is just the star screws. Instead of the basic screws like they used to have. That's good and even. Before I lock everything down. but it don't feel like it's going any further so we got that part now let's go on to attaching this under base with the shorter screws which will be this piece right here which fits down here so let me make sure I'm putting this on right uh let's see Alrighty then I don't know if there's a specific side you had to put this on, but it really doesn't look like it matters. Let me see. I'm going to be sitting in this. Um, I'm left-handed, so I'll put it on my right side. Let's get these screws in here. This is fairly easy to put together, you guys. I can say that much. It wasn't as hard as I was expecting it to be. I had planned on relaxing because I'm supposed to be off today, but I got called in once again, and not just for today. I was supposed to be off in the next three days. I would have been loving those three days because I've had so many shipments coming in this week, and I was really wanting to enjoy my time getting those shipments in and getting everything together, finishing off this room first of all, and finishing off my husband's man cave. We're really trying to get all this stuff together and finished, among other things. But I'm always seeming to have to go to work. Somebody always got something that's going on. Hey, but that's life. I just never know when I might need to have to be off when somebody need to come in for me. So, hey. But you do get a little tired of it when it used to be a constant thing. Honestly, I'm just speaking the truth. It, it gets get old real quick gets old real quick like please quit calling me quit calling me shucks i get tired too and i've been on overtime since about the middle of september and i'm just about worn out now 
I want to try to take some PTO time and then I put it in a little too early because it, and it, I got rejected. <laughs> and if a person like me get rejected on PTO time out of all the work I have put in already, it's kind of crazy. Okay, now, oh my goodness, we have, we've done this part. Now we just got to sit the chair on top of that. And I'm thinking we will be finished. And these little pieces, I gather that they probably go on the arms. We shall see. Okay, here we go, y'all. We've got this part together. And it sits up here like so. I won't be picking this up anytime soon, don't look like, because I'm thinking it should have locked in or did it lock in. I guess it locked in. Because I can't pick it. I can pick it up without it coming apart by me just sitting it on there like that. Look at that. Woo! -hoo -hoo. Let me put these little beautiful little golden arms on here. I think they go on like this. I don't know if it goes on top or on the bottom. I don't know if it goes that way or if it stays up the top. Hmm. But from the looks of it, I think I'm going to keep them down here at the bottom. I don't know because if I'm resting my arm, I don't need my arm resting on this cold steel. But hey, let's see. That's like that, or should I just keep it at the top, like I said? But see, that's going to slip. Now, I really don't want it slipping like that. But I don't want my arm on that coolness either. So, I guess, I guess it's an option. I guess it's an option. So, the chair is put together now. The wheels are rolling fairly nicely. It's really cute. It's not very tall, unless I just take this here and watch this. Let's see. Ooh! Yes! There it is, y'all. <laughs> it does have some good old height to it. Ugh. That's the vanity chair. I have two vanity chairs. Excuse the room. I have been opening up stuff. Along with my beautiful new mirror I just got today as well. Isn't that gorgeous? Along with the Just Slay Mirror Compact. And this also came with it, the five times magnifying mirror that came with this. Along with my beautiful, what's this called? The Hollywood Glow Plus with Bluetooth speakers. Here it is here. And I'm keeping this chair, but I will be getting rid of this chair. So that's what this chair is for. And my nice little sitting area that I created myself. So, oh, and I also got this little here, this beautiful thing here. This and this beautiful thing here, which is amazingly soft. But yeah, this is the finished product on the chair. I think I did a really good job putting this together on my own. So, let's get some of this stuff out of the way. And get this chair in its rightful position. All right. Let's move this big old bulky chair out the way. Well, yeah, because I'm going to... This chair actually comes over here. This red chair fits over here in this red and black space. That's why that chair is red and black. I put this little beautiful thing on here as decoration because that matches the rug. So, or the carpet, and that's my office space. Oh, this is also a vanity mirror that I got from Impressions Vanity as well. It also has Bluetooth speakers on it. Let you see that right quick. Here are your controls. 
This is the charger port. This is the on and off switch and the volume uh, buttons here. On the back of it, let me pull this out. There are your speakers right here. And it's nice and beautiful. And it's also champagne gold. Yep. And I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. So, hope I ain't making y'all dizzy by doing all this twisting and turning. But let me get my chair in it. Like I said, it's rightful position. Right over here with its golden family. Like so. Hey, I am happy. I am impressed. Everything is coming into form, like I said. Just like that. That is in my office space. Where sometimes I may just film over there as well. I don't know. And it really should be over here. But now that I have this small mirror over here, I don't know if I should replace that one. And bring it over here or that one and take it over there. I don't know. But so far, so good. I hope y'all like this video. And here's, let me turn this on. Let y'all see this. Hey. Uh, my, my room is almost complete. I just ordered this also, this beautiful tapestry. I got it today. Isn't that the cutest thing you've ever seen? It is so adorable. I got it today, too, and I put it up. And over here, I made this poster, which I had it over on this end here. It was much bigger, but I broke it down into a half of a poster and put it in this picture frame here. So I think that fit it perfectly. Excuse my backdrop stand. <laughs> I'm going to have it moved into the closet when I'm not using it. And then I created this little seating area here. And I got all these boxes and things all in the way. But this is my little seating area that I created. I also have the uh, Marianne Crystal Tuft uh, storage bench, which will actually sit here in the middle of the room. So then once that comes, my vanity room will be complete, and I'll be so happy and comfortable, and you know, this is also a new addition to my vanity room here, this, uh, this entertainment center section. But yeah, if you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I will have everything in the description bar where I got all these items. Well, you know where I got them from, but... I will have what they are, you know, actual names in case you want to go and purchase these products yourself. This is Sheila She's Beautiful Urban signing out till next time with this beautiful unboxing of my impressions vanity products. Love you guys. And if you want to see more videos or makeup looks, follow me on Instagram at The Urban Beauty or on Facebook at Sheila Irvin is just truly blessed on Facebook. This is Sheila. She's beautiful Irvin here on YouTube. Until next time, peace, love, and taco grease. Bye.